Interesting facts about famous people. Carl Malden, actor. One of the many actors that I grew up with, first on the big screen, then on the small. He always carried himself as an ordinary man in extraordinary circumstances. If you like this video, please like, share, or subscribe. You can check out my many other videos on my channel. The link is in the description. Now let's find out more about Carl Malden. Born Mladen George Sokulovic, 1912 to 2009, primarily a character actor. For more than 60 years, he brought an intelligent intensity and authenticity to roles in theatre, film, and television notably in classics like 1951's A Streetcar Named Desire, for which he won an Academy Award for Best Supporting Actor. 1954's On the Waterfront, 1960's Pollyanna, and 1961's One-Eyed Jacks with Marlon Brando. Molden also played in Hollywood films such as 1956's Baby Doll, 1959's The Hanging Tree with Gary Cooper, 1962's How the West Was Won, also in 1962 Gypsy, and 1970's Patton with George C. Scott. From 1972 to 1977, he played Lieutenant Mike Stone in the television crime drama The Streets of San Francisco, later the spokesman American for American Express. Express. Malden was money. an everyman, the well, one whose range real, moved hey. easily up and down the levels of society and the IQ scale. A hero or a heavy and ordinary decent guy just trying to get along. At the time of his death, Malden was said to be one of the great character actors of his time who created a number of strong performances. Molden was president of the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences from 1989 to 1992. His film acting career in the 1950s started with The Gunfighter and then 1950s Where the Sidewalk Ends and 1951's Halls of Montezuma. Also in 1951, A Streetcar Named Desire, Molden played Harold, Mitch, Mitchell, Stanley Kowalski's best friend, who starts a romance with Blanche Dubois, Vivian Lee. For this role, he won the Academy Award for Best Supporting Actor. Other films during this time included Alfred Hitchcock's 1953's I Confess, with Montgomery Clift and Anne Baxter, and On the Waterfront, where he received his second nomination for the Academy Award for Best Supporting Actor, playing a priest who influences Terry Malloy, Marlon Brando, to testify against mobster union boss Johnny Friendly, Lee J. Cobb. 1956's Baby Doll had Malden playing a man frustrated by a teenager wife. The film was condemned by the Legion of Decency and did not air long. Starring in dozens of films from the late 50s to the early 70s, such as Fear Strikes Out and Time Limit, both in 1957. The latter was Molden's only directing credit of a film. When Delma Davis was taken ill during the shooting of 1959's The Hanging Tree, Molden directed the movie for two weeks. 1960's Pollyanna appeared in Marlon Brando's directed film, 1961's One-Eyed Jacks, Birdman of Alcatraz, Gypsy, How the West Was Won, all in 1962. 1965's The Cincinnati Kid and 1970's Patton, playing General Omar Bradley. In 1963, he was a member of the jury at the 13th Berlin International Film Festival. Molden died at home in Los Angeles on July 1, 2009 at age 97. He had been poor in health for several years buried at the Westwood Village Memorial Park Cemetery in Los Angeles. Molden's friend 
and former co-star Michael Douglas wrote a tribute to Malden for Time's milestone section. He wrote, Nobody knew me as long as Carl Malden knew me. I first met him when I worked with him doing summer stock during college vacation. Carl and his wife Mona are great people. We started a friendship that continued for 70 years. If you'd like to see some of my many other videos, please check out the link in the description to go to my channel. Thanks for your time today. I hope you enjoyed the video. I appreciate likes, shares and subscribers. Drop me your comments. Bye for now.